Hi, Jay. New video Sunday night as Jay and Mavis were spotted out for the first time in nearly three months. Jay took the stage inside Hermosa Beach's Comedy and Magic Club. Afterwards, Mavis appeared upbeat while chatting with a friend. I would do exactly the same thing. I would marry the same person. <laughs> I'd do everything the same exact way. According to the docs obtained by ET, quote, Mavis has been progressively losing capacity and orientation to space and time for several years. And Jay wants to ensure Mavis has managed assets sufficient to provide for her care in the event he should die before her. At 77, Mavis is four years older than Jay. The couple, who never had children, have an estimated net worth of $455 million. Back in 2022, when Jay's face caught on fire in that near-fatal garage accident, he did not go to the hospital right away over concerns for her. My wife doesn't drive anymore, and I didn't want her stuck and not knowing what was going on. It just seemed like the right thing to do, and, it, and I think it was. A hearing is set for April 9th. Jay is asking that Mavis be excluded from attending because it could, quote, cause her undue stress, confusion, and anguish detrimental to her mental and physical health. And today in London, King Charles appeared in good health and spirits after being released from the hospital where he received surgery for an enlarged prostate. How are you feeling? The 75-year-old monarch gave a wave to spectators with Queen Camilla by his side. The king spent three nights in the hospital, which E.T. has learned was longer than anticipated. He will now take up to a month off from public engagements to recuperate. Today, the Princess of Wales was also discharged from the same hospital, but opted for a private journey home to Windsor. Kate spent 13 nights recovering from abdominal surgery. A source tells E.T. Prince William had been slipping in quietly to visit her every day and has, quote, temporarily stepped back from his royal duties in order to care for his wife. They want to keep it as normal as possible for Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis.